Hello lovelies, um, I am Rachel Brady. If you're new around here, I am a family and food blogger uh, over at mrsrachelbrady.co.uk and my YouTube channel is kind of a bit of everything, a bit of family, lots of food, stuff I like. Um, yeah, so welcome if you're new. Um, so today is my second video for Vlogtober, which is super exciting because I never have done anything like this and I, I'm a little bit guilty of kind of dipping in and out of YouTube and not sticking to my schedule. So I'm hoping Vlogtober will just bring out that uh, mojo. Well, to be honest, it already has brought out that vlogging mojo. I'm really enjoying it right now. So today, I thought I would bring you a little favorites kind of video, stuff that I'm loving right now, stuff that I'm really enjoying. Uh, let's start. I'm gonna start with this. I've just bought this. Uh, in the, I'm not going to wear it like this on holiday, Bowden Sale, uh, and that is what I'm about to bring your attention to, the Bowden Sale, and in particular, um, because all the summer stuff is in the sale now, Bowden is lovely, amazing stuff, a little bit pricey. So I really like checking out their sale. It's a wicked time to buy your summer stuff, to buy bikinis, tankinis, swimsuits. The, the This range here, it's like a mix and match thing. So if you're bigger on top than you are on the bottom like me, uh, you can sort all that stuff out. You could mix and match different styles. Um, I got this for, I think it was 20 something pounds. I'll put it, uh, all the information below with a link to the sale as well. They have tons of bikinis left where they did um, like a few days ago when I checked out the sale. Uh, yeah, it's just a really good time to buy your bikinis because they're all cheap right now. So if you're, if like me, you're going away for October half term or you've got little ones and you can just go away whenever you like, um, it's a really good time to buy your bikini now at Bowdoin. Okay, something else I'm loving. This came in the post um, and I put it to one side and I thought, I'm gonna read that later. And it's from National Trust and it's a little leaflet, the only few things in it, about their Christmas gift range. And if you have never checked out their Christmas gift range, uh, just their gift range, you really need to. It's really lovely. We have loads of uh, National Trust throws. We're a big throw family. Uh, we have loads of their throws. I've never bought their candles before, and this year I will be buying, not even necessarily for gifts, because we don't really do adult gifts in our family, um, like just for myself. I'm just gonna buy, I really like the look of the uh, winter twilight candle. Uh, that whole range looks so snugly and warm. Just just looking through this catalogue last night in bed like made me feel Christmassy and just really, you know, that cozy twinkly feeling. And you know what, there's information in there about getting a National Trust holiday cottage. There is also a code for 10% off, which I will share with you guys. So the second thing on my list that I'm loving right now is the whole gift range from the National Trust. When you buy something from the National Trust gift range or book a holiday cottage, of course the money goes to National Trust, which is a really important uh, charity um, because they, keep all our beautiful places in England, in Britain, looking beautiful. Um, a really nice gift, if you're gonna be very generous, is to buy some more National Trust membership. I love my National Trust membership, we use it all the time. Okie dokie, wokey pokey. The next thing is, sorry, that was really annoying. Um, this range, which I've shared in my uh, Saturday vlog, and I also shared it on my Insta stories. Do um, follow me on Instagram, Mrs. Rachel Brady. I'm like all over the stories all the time. Uh, um, yeah, it's a range called Your Good Skin. It's from Boots, and it's developed apparently with a community of like thousands of women. I mean, I saw it, I went into boot, my local boots to grab some uh, day cream and night cream, which is kind of like my standard. I go for like a really mid range that's always on offer in boots. I've done the whole really expensive skincare thing. I've done the whole cheap Aldi skincare thing. I tend to go somewhere in the middle because I'm like, I don't know, sometimes I feel like I can afford that stuff. Sometimes I feel like it's a rip off. Do you know what? I like this range because it does all the it does all the right stuff. It's got all the nice ingredients. It's got SPF 30 in the day cream, which is really important, even in winter, as all my friends tell me all the time. And it's got a serum, which if you're over 30, you should be using a serum. 
Um, and I kind of, I have used serum in the past, but I've been a bit rubbish about it recently. So uh, yeah, the face wash, which is really, really nice. You, use it with a fl you can use it with a nice flannel if you really want to get that nice, beautiful scrubbed feeling. Um, I follow up with a toner that I've actually got upstairs from another range. Uh, but you don't have to. Uh, then I put the serum on, day and night, the serum. And then you have your day cream here and your night cream here. Uh, I have oily skin, I do get the odd spot. I'm gonna draw your attention to one right now. There, um, so, but this range, pretty because I'm 38 now, my oily skin has calmed a little. It's a balancing range and it just, it doesn't go super greasy, but it gives you that nice dewy finish. I just really like it, and it's a really good price right now. It's a third off in boots. This isn't an advert or a sponsored post or anything like that. I will link below. It's a third off, so I got four products for £24 or thereabouts. I checked it, and that was right. Uh, people were like, really? Like, yeah. Uh, yeah. My next thing on the list is this. My Good Food magazine. Um... I subscribed to this on one of those offers. Um, you know, you see them, it's like, sign up. It was like um, six copies for five pounds or something like that. And then I do what they hope you'll do, which is forget to cancel it after the offer runs out. But, and do you know what? I thought, oh, I should cancel that. And then I thought, no, don't cancel it. Enjoy the magazine, take it out as your me time. It's another great idea for a gift, for a Christmas gift, or just for like a gift to yourself. They always have subscriber offers on. I will try and find one and link to it below because that is the best time to subscribe. If you are into your food, it's a really great um, magazine to get. Um, it's got low, it's not like high brow, high haute couture type, haute cuisine type uh, food. Loads of family food ideas. I don't nick these ideas in case that's what you're thinking, but I definitely take inspiration from them. Um, for instance, there was a recipe in last month for a haddock uh, mac and cheese. I'm not gonna nick that recipe because it was really different. It had truffle oil and loads of different really luxurious things. I'm just gonna take inspo from it and I'm gonna do my own version. But um, yeah, it's just really, really nice. It has restaurant reviews, it has the subscriber edition. You have loads of like um, offers and events. And it's just really good and I'm really enjoying, when this drops through my letterbox, I take like 15 minutes out and I have a coffee and I sit and I read it. And if I get interrupted, I note down where I've got to and I come back and I read more and I'm really enjoying it right now. The last thing on my list is something to watch. And every now and then when Adam is really tired, he goes to bed like stupidly early and I am downstairs and I think I'm gonna watch it because he's not here and it is the real housewives of new york city and it's on it sorry i don't know what's wrong with me to just ignore the stupid voices um it's on itvb and if you've never watched it before which loads of you will have watched it the reason i love this particular real housewives series is because um, there's characters in it that were in the original Real Housewives of New York City, which started when I had Arthur, which was seven years ago. And when I first had Arthur, you know what it's like when you've just had a baby, you are kind of just sat breastfeeding or bottled or whatever on the sofa a lot of the time. And I really got into this series and the character Bethany was in it then, the character Ramona, the character of, um, you know, the Duchess, whatever they call her, Lou, Luanne was in it. Uh, they're just crazy women. I absolutely adore them all and I would happily be friends with them all. I just, I cannot take my eyes off the screen when that is on TV and it's like a real guilty pleasure. It's not even a guilty pleasure, it's just a pleasure. It's just an amazing programme to watch. So if you are down in the dumps or you just have a bit of time to kill or you want some me time, grab yourself a coffee and sit down and watch that on ITVB, catch, ITVB yeah, catch up on your iPad or TV. Okay guys, so that is five things I'm loving right now. My second video for Vlogtober. I really hope you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Tell me below what are you loving right now. I really want to know. Skincare, YouTube channels, magazines, clothes, just anything, 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 anything. I really love it when we interact, so do tell me. And hit subscribe if you've not done already. That's it, bye.